or something is standing there. Hello there, hello, back with another scary video, ghost video. After watching these videos, you will have to sleep with the light on. Ghost Reel 5 The Alley the Ghost, ghost. Um, 12 a.m. Okay, it's quite dark, pitch dark. <sighs> okay, so there's a ghost in the alleys. Imagine you're coming at home after partying drunk uh, no idea where you are and you meet with the ghost it's around midnight mm. when the cctv footage was captured by rajiv singh in india it shows a security camera covering a doorway in an alley from at 18 india. seconds in we see a mist appear over the doorway it hovers there for a second then it strangely appears to fly up towards the right of the screen yes at around 32 seconds in, we see more strange that movement at the bottom yes. of the screen. What is that? And that's followed by this creepy shadow figure walking straight down the alley towards the camera. Do you think this is just a glitch in the CCTV? Or is this okay. an actual ghost caught on camera? I'm not really sure what's going on in this footage, but it gives me the creeps. Ah, uh, that seems spooky. I mean... What is that figure that's disappearing like that? It cannot be an animal, of course. It can't be a person also. I mean, the movement is quite a zigzag, zigzag. I mean, it's not... I don't know. It's not human-like. Maybe it's just the... What? Dew or something? It says 18th. February 2021 it was February it was winter right so during winter it's it's possible that it was fog or dew or something like that right just being optimistic what is that can you make that out let me know if you do Number I'm not four. very convinced it's a ghost the lab ghost this video comes lab to us from ghost. extract lab Extract Lab is a botanical extraction technology based company, so this video seems pretty legit. When the video okay, starts, we see this technician working. Okay. Then he seems he's like he's distracted by a noise. Something that moved behind. I'm not sure what was that? Those that jars, but one just went flying off the table and exploded. Let's all hope that's not COVID 20 that just busted all over the floor. Oh god. Oh, the technician no. leaves oh. to go get his co-worker. And when they come back, he tries to explain what happened. How did it fly and fall off just like that? How did that happen? And why just that one jar and not the other one? Together, as they leave the room, it looks like they're kind of arguing about what, what's going on what happened. Damn it. What is... When the original technician returns with the mop and bucket to clean up the mess, another jar is mysteriously moving on the counter. What do you guys think of this video? To me, this video looks legit. This looks like How real that look? activity caught on camera. Oh my Number god. Three. Yeah, it did move. The school ghost. Oof. You know, schools are, I don't know why and what is the rationale behind this, but every school everywhere has some haunted story, you know, behind it. This school was made on a cemetery. The school is haunted. The bathroom on top, top right, that is haunted. You go straight and then that floor is haunted. <laughs> that building is haunted. Here there was a cymmetry. Here you have seen some, heard, heard some noises and all of that. That is everywhere. Earlier when I was small and when I was in school, I thought this is only me. This was happening with only my school and only, you know, basically my badge and everything. But 
as I grew up and as I met people from all around the world in college and all of those places and of course now with social media and internet I'm getting to hear this is the same story everywhere every school almost every school I would not say every school have children school children have this story circulating around I don't know where it originates from but it does originate somewhere and it definitely gets spread like fire so and as children you believe them because that's what children do we believe in fairies we believe in magic pencils we believe in ghosts also in that time it was shit scary i would never go to that place that you know was haunted or where they heard noises supposedly i would not even think of stepping there even in my dreams so yeah is this CCTV footage an elaborate thing? I don't know what is with the school goes there though. This footage no is jump from Deer Park CBS, the oldest and most haunted school on the south side of Cork City. Let's watch the video from January 10th, 2017. Oh my god, and people still go the in there? Students? Sounds coming from down the when you know a school is haunted, why would you send your children there? Why would that place operate if it's legit scary or ghostly then you should just shut that down or bless it or something then at about 34 seconds into the video what happened there the lockers someone on the left moved? start someone moved. Back and forth. <gasps> oh, i'm scared now <laughs> This was scary. Oh, holy. This video kind of gives me the chills. <sighs> this is scary. This is shit scary. So, what do you guys think? Is this a prank? Mm -hmm. Me too. Who is officially out? <gasps> Number two. Damn it. The, how did the bell ring? How did the... How did the bell ring? This was scary. This was this literally was scary. I mean, the way those lockers were banging, the doors were shutting, the the paper, whatever that was, was flying around, and the bell rang from nowhere. That shit was scary. I mean, if even it, even if it was orchestrated, it was done massively well. I mean so good whoever that person was should actually direct a horror movie because it looked so real but i don't think that was orchestrated but i don't know these things these days are unbelievable so i don't know but it was shit scary i i got shivers down my spine watching that literally i was shivering for that second i I, for a second I felt I should just pause this and uh, go and you know chant the name of God or so something like that it was that scary how do people go and study that is that school operational why is it operational damn it I am just getting scared just looking at my own reflection in the lens now. Shit. Okay, next one. The bedroom ghost. The bedroom ghost. The following clip was filmed while my mom and I were on vacation. We decided to leave our cats home alone for the few nights we would be gone. We scheduled a house sitter to come by and check up on them every other morning. When we arrived back home, we noticed a strange change in their behavior. So we decided to review the footage. This is what we found. This cat on the bed looks like it's on high alert. And if you look down the mm. hallway, you can see a creepy shadow passing over mm. the door. 
This is either the a dad can feel something. Uh, what if it's the sitter that person it? What is that? Also check There's out another this cat? chair and the TV table and the cat's reaction. Okay. Uh, how is it moving? When the other cat comes into the room, the door closes. Oh wow, that is scary. Shit, if I saw it this closing? on my security camera when I came home from vacation, I would think it's time to move. Seriously, I would never go and live in that place ever again. I just move, run, <laughs> pick whatever I have and just just move. I mean God. Tell me it was the sitter on office ghost. This really creepy. This is another level now. Even offices, yeah. Building. We have heard a lot about offices too that no. you know there are some cave ins or some meeting rooms that are haunted. I have heard this in, in a couple of offices I've worked, so yeah. I don't know if it's a common thing in office too, just like in schools, but I think it is. I think so many people are burdened by work and all of that that even after they go they don't really go they leave a part of their soul it's behind there. which haunts the other people or so he thinks <sighs> or it's something serious he's just working and then he hears a noise behind him so he gets up and goes to I check mean. it out but did you see the light come like, on? how are you are you working alone in the office and here's a different angle it, there should at least be one other somebody else, right? Side. Somebody I else there. I mean, door swings open. The dedication and all is fine, but what if something happens, you know? Light. He returns to his desk to continue working. But okay. then a flash of light catches his eye. Yeah. And he gets up to investigate. Lush. Oh God! What if there's someone who's come to steal or commit a crime or something? I mean, yeah, there is a possibility, of course, but there is also a possibility of real people who are criminals who so could just barge in, you know, breaking open the security somehow. Next. And he's the only person in there and he becomes the victim, you know, that is also a danger. Don't tell me he's going to work again. You should just go, leave, leave. Ooh, what is happening? Where do I look? You need to go home, buddy. This is crazy. Oh, 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 oh. The, the chair moved. The door slams and the chair oh. rolls. And he takes off running for his life. He's scared out of oh, his wits. God. If this video is staged, then they didn't Seriously, really good job. man. How did you even stage something like this? Now, this is where it gets really creepy. The light pops back on. Shit. I think he just left the office forever after this night. And someone or something is standing there. So what do you guys think? Is this staged? Or is this a real ghost caught on camera? Shit. I don't think he would ever go back there. That shadow was creepy. God. <sighs> Good thing I'm working from home. Anyway, I hope you found this spooky enough. Let me know in the comments below. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you like it. I'll be back with more as always.